Tex Dorkin, Ivan Evans Houths, uh, Jeannie Stone, <coughs> Carolyn Burnett, Michael Hahn, Gina Ko, Skate Stone, that's a great name, uh, Wendy Testo, Testo, Chris George, Bobby Lee, Mary Angento. Evening, my name is Steve Arnold. I'm a San Francisco native. My wife, my wife grew up in Half Moon Bay. She and I met in architecture school in Oregon, and having since moved back down here in 1984, we've lived here continuously. All three of our girls were born and raised here. We bought our first house in 1988, a two-bedroom in the Sunnyside neighborhood, which we remodeled into three, but outgrew anyway. We bought our second house in 2005, a three-bedroom two blocks away, which we remodeled into four, just in the nick of time as our first girl entered high school. The last one left for college in the fall, so now we have an empty nest. We had to borrow for college, and we were using that empty nest to help pay off all those college loans via Airbnb. We believe we have earned that privilege through sweat equity, and we have the right to make use of our own home as we see fit, as long as it poses no harm to others. Regarding any impact that home sharing guests may have on the local neighborhood, if anything, it has a positive effect, for it enriches the neighborhood and helps local businesses. The Airbnb selection process is geared to weed out bad apples, and it turns out that strangers can be quite interesting people. We support the regulations just recently adopted. We have promptly begun our registration process with the planning department and support the TOT that, that the city currently collects from Airbnb as our guests use city services. The current regulations make sense as they were crafted to allow homeowning middle-class San Francisco residents the freedom to use their homes as they choose. We ask if you consider additional legislation, you keep this principle in mind. Thank you. Thank you.